How to hang a gym mirror. A gym mirror is a great finishing touch for your home gym or dance studio. It can make the space seem bigger, give the room a professional feeling, and of course help you with your workout. Installing a gym mirror simply requires some planning ahead, a helper, and the right tools. Setting up. Determine where you want to hang your mirror. Gym mirrors come in various sizes but the standard widths are 3 and 4 feet 0.91 and 1.22 meters and the standard heights are 6 and 7 feet 1.8 and 2.1 meters. Kits are available that include 1, 2, 3, 5, and 10 mirrors. Keep in mind that you'll need a little space on the top of the mirror to install the mirror clips. If you want to have the mirrors reach down to floor level, be sure to check for electrical outlets. Most outlets are 18 to 24 inches 46 to 61 centimeters off the floor. You will still be able to see your full body from 2 to 3 feet 0.61 to 0.91 meters back if you hang your gym mirror to accommodate outlets. Purchase your gym mirror if you haven't already. Now that you know where you would like to put your gym mirror, you know what size you need. You can call and place an order with a mirror and glass company. Many companies offer to install the mirror for you, sometimes for free and sometimes for a fee. Inquire about this option, especially if you have multiple mirrors to install or the installation is for a professional gym rather than a home gym. Choose mirrors that are at least 4 inch 0.64 centimeters thick. Thin glass shatters easily and is dangerous in a gym setting. If you have some extra money in your budget, consider glass less gym mirrors. They are just as reflective but are nearly shatter proof. Use AJ bar, mirror clips, and mirror glue for your installation. If you have purchased a brand new gym mirror, it will come with the necessary hardware for installation. If you have a used gym mirror that didn't come with any hardware, you will need AJ bar and anchor screws to hang it. AJ bar sometimes called AJ channel is what the bottom edge of the mirror will be placed in for support. If you are hanging multiple gym mirrors side by side, your J bar can be the length of all of the mirrors combined. Two mirror clips for the top edge of each mirror and two anchor screws to install them. Mirror glue. Make sure to use glue specific for mirrors, since other types of glue can damage the silver lining on the back of the mirror. AJ bar and anchor screws to hang it. AJ bar sometimes called AJ channel is what the bottom edge of the mirror will be placed in for support. If you are hanging multiple gym mirrors side by side, your J bar can be the length of all of the mirrors combined. Point two mirror clips for the top edge of each mirror and two anchor screws to install them. Mirror glue. Make sure to use glue specific for mirrors, since other types of glue can damage the silver lining on the back of the mirror. Schedule an installation time with an able-bodied friend. These mirrors are large and awkward to carry and hold. Count on needing help. Scheduling ahead of time will make it stress-free for both of you. Provide your friend with work gloves and ask them to wear close-toed shoes. Clean the entire wall space that will be covered by the mirror. Use cleaning wipes, rubbing alcohol, or warm soapy water. Wipe the wall and allow it to dry before installation. This will help ensure that the mirror glue will bond strongly to the wall. Unpackage the mirror on the floor near where you will be hanging it. Place the cardboard up against the wall to protect the wall from the edges of the mirror when you prop it up. Put the styrofoam padding from the packaging down on the floor in front of the cardboard to protect the floor. Consider wearing work gloves when you are lifting the mirror and wear close-toed shoes to protect your feet.